A Metro officer killed in the line of duty was honored today with a special memorial marker. In 2007, Tennessee passed the move over law, which required motorists to move into another lane upon seeing a stopped emergency vehicle. Then in May of 2014, a driver of a motorhome didn't follow that law. As a result, Metro Police Officer Michael Petrina directing traffic on I-65 around a TDOT assistance truck was hit and killed. Thank you to everyone for being here today. Today, Officer Petrina was remembered by friends, family, and state and local officials with the Officer Michael Petrina Memorial Interchange. State Representative Jason Powell, who along with Senator Steve Dickerson, worked with the 109th General Assembly to have the interchange named after Officer Petrina, he spoke of the need to follow this law to the letter. One is a reminder uh, to the public of the, the need to, to move over. Nashville Mayor Megan Barry never met the officer, but said she felt as if she knew him. I do know what members of his academy class say about him, and he was an example for them. He had an incredible work ethic, an infectious energy. Police Chief Steve Anderson says Officer Petrina took pride in the responsibility that came with being an officer. These are his words. The strength that I have gained because of my family support has helped me to make my decision for a law enforcement career, and I will serve the city of Nashville, my country, and most importantly, make my family proud. And his family extremely proud, his brother Anthony signing the back of the memorial sign with the words, he made everybody better by example. It wasn't a specific quote, it wasn't said explicitly by anybody, it was an amalgamation of everything that everyone had said during that week, everyone who trained with Michael, who worked with Michael, who were friends with Michael, his, fr his family, his friends, everybody, and is the most true thing we could put. Officer Petrina was awarded the Officer Christy Dedman Spirit Award for showing a positive spirit and motivation while in Metro's Police Training Academy. Ironically, in 2004, Officer Dedman was killed while assisting a motorist on I-40.